Martha and the Vandellas then and now. Martha and the Vandellas were an American vocal girl group formed in Detroit in 1957. The group achieved fame in the 1960s with Motown. During their nine-year run on the charts from 1963 to 1972, Martha and the Vandellas charted over 26 hits and recorded in the styles of doo-wop, R&B, pop, blues, rock and roll and soul. Ten Vandellas songs reached the top ten of the Billboard R&B singles chart, including two R&B number ones, and six top ten pop hits on the Billboard Hot 100. Selected members of the group were inducted into the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame in 1995 and the National Rhythm and Blues Hall of Fame in 2013. In this video we are going to focus on Martha and the Vandellas then and now. On our channel we feature such videos. Remember to like, comment and subscribe to our channel for such. Martha Reeves Martha Rose Reeves, born July 18, 1941, is an American R&B and pop singer. She is the lead singer of the Motown girl group Martha and the Vandellas which scored over a dozen hit singles. After leaving Motown and moving to Los Angeles, Reeves was signed by MCA by late 1973. Her first project, released in January 1974, was the soundtrack for the blaxploitation film Willie Dynamite with jazz trombonist J. J. Johnson. In Los Angeles, Reeves took acting classes at the Lee Strasberg Institute. She appeared in the movie Fairy Tales and on the television series Quincy, Me. Reeves also appeared on TV game shows such as Hollywood Squares. From 2005 until 2009, Reeves served as an elected councilwoman for the city of Detroit, Michigan. After serving on the Detroit City Council from 2005 to 2009, Reeves returned to full-time performing with nearly 50 shows annually, including a major tour of Australia in 2010. Martha continues to perform concerts and club dates both solo and with her Vandella sisters Lois, Motown-era Vandella since 1967, and Delphine, since mid-1980s. She is currently 81 years old. Rosalind Ashford Rosalind Roz Ashford Holmes, born September 2, 1943, is an American soprano R&B and soul singer, known for her work as an original member of the Motown singing group Martha and the Vandellas. In 1978, Rosalind was convinced to join Martha and Annette in a reunion performance while performing for a benefit concert for actor Will Gear. Eleven years later, the three original Vandellas recorded the single, Step Into My Shoes, for the London-based Motor City Records label. Since then, she and Annette Beard have continued to perform often billing themselves as the original Vandellas with lead vocalist, Rochelle Lafon, rarely reuniting with Martha. She is currently 79 years old. Annette Beard Annette Beard also known as Annette Helton or Annette Sterling, is an American R&B and soul singer. Beard is best known for her work with Motown and as an original member of the singing group Martha and the Vandellas during the 1960s. Having remained in touch with her former bandmates, she reunited again with Reeves and Ashford, releasing the Heat Wave style pop of Step Into My Shoes in 1989. This reunion led to several tours across the US and UK. In 2005, after 30 years of employment in the outpatient lab of St. John's Hospital, Beard retired. As of 2011, the group continue perform all over the world as, the original Vandellas, with lead singer, Rochelle Lafon. Beard is currently known as a member of the singing group The Original Vandellas. Williams died of diabetes complications in Detroit on July 5, 2000. She was 57 years old. Lois Reeves. Sandra Dolores Reeves, born April 12, 1948, better known as Lois Reeves, is an American singer, most notable for being the younger sister of Motown legend Martha Reeves, for having replaced popular Martha and the Vandellas member Betty Kelly as member of her sister's group in 1967, and for later singing background for records by Al Green in the 1970s as a member of the backing group Quiet Elegance. In the late 1970s, Lois quit singing and opened a night spot in Detroit with her then-husband. A few years later she closed the business, got divorced, and found herself back on the road as a Vandella. Lois continues singing with her sisters as Martha Reeves and the Vandellas. She continues to reside in Detroit where she lives near her siblings and occasionally does consultant work for the NAACP, Detroit chapter. Lois has also been involved with work for the Detroit Symphony Orchestra. She is currently 74 years old. Betty Kelly Betty Kelly, born September 16, 1944, is an American singer most noted as being a member of the popular Motown singing group Martha and the Vandellas. 
Kelly was fired from the group in the summer of 1967 about the same time that Florence Ballard was fired from the Supremes and was replaced by Martha's younger sister Lois Reeves with the group's name changed to Martha Reeves and the Vandellas. After her Motown years, Kelly moved to California, where she worked for a savings and loan association until her retirement. Kelly left the music industry after she became partially deaf in one ear. She is currently 78 years old. Gloria Williams Gloria Williams, born August 1, 1942, was an American singer notable for being the original lead singer of an early incarnation of Martha and the Vandellas under the name, The Delphi's. On the single's flip side, You'll Never Cherish a Love So True, she shares the lead with Rosalind Ashford, who recorded a spoken part. However, when the single flopped, a frustrated Williams left the group leaving the band as a trio. The group went on to international fame with Reeves as lead singer under the name of Martha and the Vandellas. Thank you for watching, remember to subscribe and hit the notification button. See you on the next video.